Hey you guys, it's day four. We're in St. Thomas. Starting out in the observation lounge. We're here. They do have a little light breakfast here in the observation lounge. I'm whispering because it's just quiet and <laughs> we're just going to get some eat real quick before we go meet for our tour. I absolutely love this lounge and I'm going to show you what they have here for breakfast. They have yogurt, muesli, fruits, lots of fruits and danishes. It's like a very just quick continental breakfast. Muffins and rolls. And over here they have cereal and milk. There you go. And grab something quick to eat and have a nice, nice view. So there's our breakfast and there is my breakfast view. Isn't it gorgeous? They're usually standing up in the Lido telling people they can bring their plates down here. It's, uh, it's like overflow seating also, so it's just a really nice place to sit. Listen to the Christmas music. It was just like this on the escape in December. It's Christmas music, but it's kind of like old Christmas music and sometimes you just hear like woo when you open the door and it's kind of creepy. We are currently in the process of docking the ship and having it cleared by the local officials. We do kindly request that all guests relax in the public spaces and lounges until the ship is officially cleared. Once so, I will make an announcement for location of the gateways. So please refrain from congregating around the gateway areas and the stairways. It's so quiet on the ship right now. I had everyone meet the Sugarcane Mojito Bar because it's an open place in the middle of the ship where we can easily get off the ship together, but there's 27 of us for this tour. Gerard has to come with us to St. Thomas. <laughs> no way we can get all these people in one elevator. <laughs> yeah, uh, Trevon, you go with one group and Minara. <laughs> That's not going to happen. You good? You still have another room. You're all good. Yeah. Okay, see you in a minute. <laughs> it's not working. <laughs> I'll just do the steps, so. No, we can get in. Yeah. We're in. Okay, see you downstairs. Yeah, there's still room. There's still room. Yeah, I'll just take the Yeah, I'll go on the stairs with him. I just want to make sure if ever got an elevator. <laughs> yeah, baby. Yeah, we finally got an elevator. Uh, Every elevator that came was full, so we just had to get them on an up elevator to come down. <laughs> St. Thomas. I'm so excited. Oh, it's warm. Okay, there we are. Who's excited? <laughs> Look at the ship. So we're going with David's Fun Tours, what we did last time we were here because they were so amazing. And we asked for the same tour driver. Look at the whole art on the ship. Yeah, the Crown Princess. I've been on that one too. So I loved it. So uh, the guy that gave us a tour last time wasn't available. Wah, he was awesome. So we have another tour guide. <laughs> There's a new truck this time because he said, you remember what, what happened last time. That's funny. Yeah, anybody with like motion? You want to be up close. Anybody with like motion, you want to be close. So we got everybody in rows of five like we're supposed to. And this is a new bus. We're going to go to Emerald Beach today. I did. Oh, that. Look, there's a crown princess and the Norwegian bliss. Look how huge it looks. It doesn't feel that big on site. The way that they have it laid out. Look how pretty the ships are over there. There's town right here. You can walk from the cruise ships. They're right there. Wow, no. <laughs> Views don't get too much better than this. Isn't that gorgeous? It's only us and the Crown Princess here today. I know this is not busy at all, and there's no ships over there either. It's just so gorgeous. See islands over there. A very faded image of Saint Croix. Right here, this bench right here, and actually weighed wreak havoc in a Spanish ship that actually. I don't know what this place is called. I literally don't remember. But this is our second, third stop. And it's actually literally so gorgeous. It's crazy like how different 
everything looks when you're higher up. And like even the water, like it looks so smooth and like silky. Mountain top. What's the matter? Why is everybody saying hello? Why are we soft? <laughs> oh, we're just waiting for cars. There's nothing wrong here. <laughs> it's a brand new bus. <laughs> he looked up and saw that. Look at his face. That's creepy. Oh my gosh, the glass oh, up here on the outside. The, some of the branches whap at you. So if you're on the outside, you have to be careful. Who remembers this from my uh, Carnival Magic Cruise vlogs? The banana daiquiri where I got a cup as a souvenir. And the daiquiri was so delicious. Look at that. Thank you. Did you get smacked by a bush? Yeah, I just want to try. <laughs> We traded out so other people could experience being slapped by bushes or tree branches. It's just something you gotta experience on one of these tours. <laughs> Back in the town area, but we're going to Emerald Beach. I have never been there before. <laughs> I found my Dr. Pepper. Oh, okay. Time stamp. Time stamp. Time stamp. It is 10.54 a.m. Okay, and when do we have to be back? Be back here by 1 p.m. Okay, where are we? Emerald Beach Emerald Resort. Emerald yeah. Beach yeah. in yeah. St. Thomas. Woo! Nude Beach. <laughs> nude Beach. Oh my God, said nude. <laughs> Not nude. She wants to go to the Nude Beach. I thought she said Nude Beach. Hey. <laughs> Oh, I would go. Low. I would go to the new beach. I, mean, I, I wouldn't get, know get nude. I don't think they want. I don't think they want watchers there. You probably have to be nude. And no, I don't want to be nude. But no, me neither. Nude. But I would peek. I would peek at the nude beach. Thank you. <laughs> hey, I was on a carnival when they had the new, the topless deck. You did? And my husband and I went. I didn't. No, I mean, he tried, but to get me to. But I was like, it was fun. <laughs> Look at this. This is Emerald Beach, and he Very said there wasn't no, any charge. Look at this. No no! So nice. There's food. <gasps> Look at the view. Oh my gosh, there's a pool. You could just... Okay, pools for hotel guests only. <laughs> and who wants to go to pool when you go on the beach? But it's still very nice. Look at it. Isn't this nice because there's shade? Look at this. Oh, this is what I'm talking about. This is the kind of beach I'm talking about right here. This is beautiful. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna put my waterproof case on now. It's gonna be slightly muffled, but you can still hear. We're going in. Yeah, I put it over there with Trevon. He's staying at the table. Uh oh, he is absolutely painful. <laughs> He's Tommy a sweetie. Oh my God. He's a sweetheart. Look at this, guys. Emerald Beach. Oh, it's kind of cold. Oh, it's in liquid air, air conditioning. Oh my God, yes, it feels good. It really, whoa, there's a big dip there. You know the drill, we gotta dunk all in at one time. Ready? Yeah, let's get off the rocks. That rocks in my crocs. Ha, it rhymes. Rocks and crocs. Oh, well, the further back you go, the deeper it gets. Okay. Come over here. I can't get a rock out of my crocs. Angela, come over here. I can't. Oh, big rock. All right, ready? Okay, ready? Ready? It feels good. So yes. Yeah, I actually feel light for the first time in a few months. Oh. <laughs> no aches, no pain. Oh. Oh. Wow, this is boiling water. There you go. This is nice. <laughs> Amy has and it natural feels natural. nice. Amy has natural. Yeah. What did she say? natural buoys. I float no matter what. I do. I have natural buoys built in. You've been saying I float. I can never get to the bottom of the pool. It's so nice, come on! No, 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 it says it's, it's not, it's good. It just feels cold for a second. Yeah, there's hard rocks over there, you gotta come out past them. Nice beach, huh? 
I know you guys just dunk down. That's what we did. We made ourselves just dunk. But it's very salty, I guess, because it's hard for me not to just float to the top. How do you like it? Is it nice? I totally instantly like this better than Megan's Bay, even though it looks very similar when you're in the water. <laughs> That's gorgeous. Look at it. The conversations in the background of this video are probably going to be so funny. <laughs> I'm going farther out, I think it's going to get deeper, and I feel like it's getting more shallow. I'm just going to keep going until it gets a little deeper. I'm going to give you guys POV here of my view. Water level. Just so you know, we had two hours here, but he gave us up to four hours here. We just did not want to stay here for four hours. We would all be fried. Fried. That's true. Oh, well, we said two was good. Okay, good. Oh, yeah. I'm actually standing up right now, and it's right now ready to go. It's neck level, and this is how far we are out from. I take that back. It's ear level. Watch. Here we go. I'm going to stand. Ready? Oh, it's neck level. It changes every second. I know. Like, stand. Yeah. Five, seven. I'm going to show you guys underneath the water because I don't know what it looks like. So before we leave, I just want to show you this beach again. It's Emerald Beach. There's no charge to come here. Uh, you can just get a taxi to drop you off. There's not many ships in port today. Only two actually, so it's not busy. But here is the beach. It's calm. It's quiet. It's peaceful. It's gorgeous. It's just, it was just a wonderful day and the water was super. And there's food here. It is expensive. It's like $18 for veggie pizza, $12 for nachos. And you don't, you get a lot of chips, but you hardly get any dip and drinks and stuff, which are average price for a restaurant on the beach. But uh, still, we all got some food and stuff. Time to board the sunny bus and head back to the ship. Bye. Once again, you guys, David's fun tours. It was amazing. It was awesome. What did you guys think of the tour? I thought it was super beautiful. I loved it. I loved it. Like it. <laughs> very family, family tour guide. Huh? Very family tour guide. Very, but that's very important. Yeah. Did you like it? Absolutely. Yeah, that Thank was so well worth it. Yeah. That was a good time. Back of the ship, and you got to show your ID and your shipboard card. So you're going to check them here at the gate to let you in there. See, ship cards and photo ID required upon re entry. See, and this is another thing I like about Norwegian is that when you come back, they have, you know, water and stuff, and usually. Ice cold towels and maybe that's lemonade, I don't know. They don't have many things right now for some reason, I don't know why. Covered seating, I don't know why necessarily, because you're almost on the ship, but you know. <laughs> why? I don't know. Man, my face is burning. Look, Norwegian bliss. <laughs>